Well, Mary Kay, it looks like the Josh Gordon era is officially going to come to an end in Cleveland. He checks himself into rehab, and, and Hugh Jackson all but said today that the Browns are done with Josh Gordon. He kind of said it without saying it, but it's safe to assume that it's over. Yeah, he really did basically say, we're moving on, we're closing this chapter, and he made it very clear that it is over for Josh Gordon here. And uh, it's really a sad and unfortunate situation, considering that uh, he's the most naturally gifted receiver that I have ever seen uh, in 20-some years years of covering this football team and it's a great career gone down the drain at least in Cleveland. Yeah and, and, you know so many players when, when they would talk about Josh Gordon you know there was some excitement I think in this locker room and, and Terrell Pryor was getting a little bit excited about it that boy when Josh Gordon comes back this offense really has found something but at the same time you know, I don't know if they thought about it the same way we did, but it's awfully tough to count on a guy like that. It is, but you know what? He looked so good during <laughs> training camp, and you know, you get tantalized again that you know what? I'm sure Browns fans thought, uh, you know, here we go, and uh, it's really, it's really again sad and unfortunate because even in that Tampa game when he caught passes of 44 and 43 yards, he almost looked like the Josh of old, and he seemed humbled, he seemed grateful, and I really thought this time he was going to make a go of it. Yeah, unfortunately for Josh. Making catches like that in Tampa has, has never really been the problem for him. It's been the other stuff. So he checks himself into rehab. The Browns uh, done with Josh Gordon. We'll have complete coverage of that today at cleveland.com slash Browns.